All right, we're going back over to Mike Eppel at 680, and we're talking about Facebook and Instagram and some big players leaving the game. Yeah, the founders of Facebook, uh, good morning, Melanie. The founders of, uh, sorry, Instagram are leaving Facebook. Uh, Mark, uh, Cry Mike Krieger and Kevin Systrom, uh, back in 2012, sold Instagram to Facebook for the, at that time, uh, hefty sum of $700 million. Now, back then, there were 13 employees and about 30 million users of Instagram. Today, it has over a billion users on a monthly basis. But internally, Instagram has sort of been a separate entity from Facebook, at least until recently, according to published reports. Mark Zuckerberg has been looking more at the day-to-day -day operations of Instagram and uh, the founders of Instagram not liking the loss of autonomy, so they're leaving the company, saying it's time to go on to other ventures. We are watching Facebook shares down by about 2% in pre-market trade and down about 8% year-to-date. Markets on high alert this morning because of a higher price for oil. The international benchmark price for crude is north of $82 per barrel now. Here in Canada, the Canadian producers are getting much less than that, almost a $40 discount. But globally, the uh, North Sea crude price out of the U.K. is uh, caused an effect from what OPEC does. And they're not making any changes to production quotas. And this could have a ripple effect through the Canadian energy market because we import oil from the uh, European marketplace, and that could lead to higher prices of the gas pumps over the course of this week, so we'll track that as well. Sometimes it's not about the deal, but it's about how you sell it. The CEO of Empire Company, parent of Sobeys, is promising not to mess up uh, Farm Boy after Empire announced a purchase of the uh, company, which has currently 26 locations across Ontario. Empire looking to greatly expand the Farm Boy brand, though, in this province, specifically in urban centers, specifically here in Toronto. They might even be converting some current Sobeys locations into the Farm Boy branding. And we also have the U.S. Central Bank starting a two-day meeting on interest rate policy coming up today. Another thing we're watching is the lack of NAFTA negotiations. Nothing formal on the NAFTA talks as that end-of-month deadline fast approaches. And uh, discussions that uh, no top-level discussions are planned for this week. So we'll see where that goes.